floor plates, tennis rackets, spacecraft. They all have one thing in common, carbon fiber. Lightweight yet incredibly strong, carbon fiber fabric is one of the most revolutionary materials of the last 30 years. Engineers use a newer version called HJ3. It's one of several varieties of fabric currently manufactured to reinforce all kinds of structures, like highway pillars and tunnel walls. The Smash Lab team wants to put this super cloth to a daring new test, using the fabric to protect a home against one of nature's most violent storms, Category 5 hurricanes. Use it to reinforce like pillars and overpasses to make them more earthquake proof, but I don't think anybody's ever put it on a house before. I know we know it's strong, but we should just test it, check it out. The fiber's molecules interlock. The structure gives the fabric its strength. To prepare the fabric, they soak it in resin, making it stiff and easier to apply. Carbon fiber's all resined up and ready to go. So cool, it's just fabric that turns yeah. to steel. So we have two beams, one with and one without carbon fiber wrap. That's okay. it, that's it, <laughs> come, come on, on. We come got on. It. There it is. 735 pounds of Smash Lab is more than a regular 2x3 can stand. And now for the carbon wrap board. Just jump on, Dan, quick. Yeah. Nothing. Bounce. Oh, that's a pretty strong board we got there. It's a, yeah, so that's just proof positive that this stuff really does structurally reinforce anything you put it on. HJ3 is really good for like deflecting beams and things like this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that proves that in this scenario, I think it would definitely help out. Mobile homes and hurricanes definitely do not mix. On a single day in Florida in August 1992, Hurricane Andrew trashed thousands of trailers. If carbon fabric could prevent even some of this kind of damage, it could be a breakthrough. The Smash Lab crew is trying something outrageous, hurricane-proofing a mobile home using carbon fiber fabric. This mobile home wears a layer of an amazing carbon fiber fabric that lends immense strength to anything it's attached to. The result should survive artificial winds as strong as a Category 5 hurricane. Really what our test is about is testing the structure of this. Yep. And I think the carbon fiber is going to do a great job. I mean, from our tests, we found, you know, the weakest points were those corners. So we've reinforced all of those, and uh, this stuff is really, really good in tension. And when that wind comes, I think the carbon fiber is really going to hold it together. All right. Okay, we're at 60 PSI. All right, I'll take I'm it. I'm going to run all it. of them, every tank. You ready? Give us a countdown. Three, two, one, fire! came loose, the mobile home turned turtle. But otherwise, it's remarkably intact. 
<laughs> it rolled and it's intact, and I am impressed. Thank very you. impressed. Thanks, actually. guys. Yeah, honestly, you, you seem very doubtful. I, I did not think it would succeed. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm quite impressed and surprised. Well, I must admit. But if it wasn't like this, I think it would have been just like the shed test uh, that we did before. It, it would have crumpled. You would have seen everything peel open, but the HJ3, like we said, is really good intention, and it just held everything together. All of those corners are still intact. Really, considering the condition in which we found this trailer, it couldn't have survived a subtle breeze, not to mention, like, a hurricane force winds. OK, so we set out to storm-proof a house against hurricane force winds using carbon fiber wrap. Success? Oh, yeah, you got it. With the proper anchors, success.